Today, I'm testing the Mariner drone in some torrential rain. Now, it's not actually raining today, but I found the next best thing. You guessed it. I've come to the fire station. With the help of the fire brigade, we'll be simulating torrential rain. In England, it's rare to get torrential rain without strong winds, so that's why I've come here. So what the firemen are going to do is fire their hoses at the drone while it's flying uh, to simulate a rainstorm. We're going to start off nice and easy, and what they've got at the moment is something called the curtain. This is the lightest of the hoses that they've got, so it should give us a good benchmark to start from. That hasn't caused any problems, so we're going to move on to the Canon. Canon is a much stronger hose that has the power to put out a lot of water. We'll start off on the weakest power that it's got. As you can see, the drone's not really struggling at all, so we'll go a bit harder. This is half power. This is already a hell of a lot more rain than I'd want to go out in. Again, half power's no problem, so we'll go on to full power now. You can see from the water coming out the hose, there's a lot of power behind it. see the Mariner fighting against the water just to keep its position, but despite this, it's doing well. Despite the battering it's taken, and the force of water coming down on it, you can still fly the Mariner in a controlled way, putting it exactly where you'd want it to get the shot. So the drone's held up really well in the fake rain, certainly heavier than anything we get here in the UK. So next we're onto the beach to test it in the sea. <laughs> 